Mexico, we work from Maine to Mexico, there's nothing like this Texaco of ours. Our show tonight is powerful, we'll wow you with an hour full of howls from a shower full of stars. We're the merry Texaco men, tonight we may be showmen, tomorrow we'll be servicing your cars. I wipe the pipe, I pump the gas, I rub the hub, I scrub the glass. I touch the clutch, I mop the top, I poke the choke, I sell the pop. I clear the gear, I block the knock, I jack the back, I set the clock. So join the ranks of those who know and fill your tanks with Texaco. Sky team, fill up with sky team, and you will smile at the pile of new miles you will add. Fire team, fill up with fire team, you'll find that Texaco's the finest friend your car has ever had. And now, ladies and gentlemen, introducing television's number one star, the man America discovered, Milton Berle. They stood up. Thank you, and good evening. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Lady, don't, please, don't laugh. Columbus, 1492. What's yours? Gimbals, 1075? <laughs> Lady, please, I'm gonna lay the egg. She's cackling. How do you like that? <laughs> How do you like that? <laughs> My mother didn't show up. I like those telescopes. Give me these. That's the kind I like. <laughs> I am a What the hell? How do you like me? Don't I look good, huh? You, uh, don't applaud. Don't applaud. We, uh, you've heard of Ezio Pinza? I look like his brother, Safety Pinza. <laughs> it's awful chilly around here. <laughs> How do you like the weather? It's been so hot these past few nights, I had to get up in the middle of the night, take off my socks. You know, it's really... I really feel... How do you like the socks? Smart socks? Uh, Brooklyn socks. Brooklyn. There's not a run in either one of them. But it is... Uh, it is really... Uh, please, now! I... Oh, incidentally, before I go any further, is there anybody in the audience from Brooklyn? I you are? How do you feel? You bird shot. I, uh, I want. I feel good. I really. Oh, you're breaking my heart because you're leaving and you're taking the furniture too. Thank you. <laughs> now, before going further, I want to sit with this lady down here, please. Would you do the tall lady? Will you? Will you? The man behind you can't see the show. <laughs> will you remove your head, please? You don't. Mind. I. Uh, oh, before going further, I want to try something new tonight. Somebody. Uh, uh, how about having all the uh, married men and women in the audience stand up? Huh? Every married man. Come on, stand up. Will you? Come on, stand up. Stand up, please. Stand up. Okay. All right, now, uh, back to me. Wait a minute, stay there, stay there. You fools, stay there. Wait a minute. Now, now, wait a minute. I'm trying something, please. Stand, will you stand up, please? Now, all the, uh, all the married, uh, uh, married men, uh, uh, everybody, uh, all the single girls stand up and the married women sit down. Now all the married men sit down and the single men stand up. Now we have all the single men and single ladies. <laughs> what are you waiting for? <laughs> Welcome to Bride and Groom. We, uh, this is, no, we, we really, we really have a very, well, I feel good. No, I feel good. We have this man down here, you're embarrassing me. You can't come in here undressed. I really mean that. This man down here. <laughs> If I've said anything to insult you, I offer you my humble. <laughs> I like it, it's all right. We, we kid everybody that comes in here. Who's your favorite comedian? Bob Hope! <laughs> Wait, 
Let everybody go. Oh, we, uh, we're going to present a very wonderful show tonight, and the show is so long, we want you to sit back and relax, and you folks that are watching the show in Chicago and Cincinnati and Detroit, have we got a show tonight? Have we got a show? Have we got a show? <laughs> I would like to introduce, as our first surprise, one of the most sensational troops ever to appear on a television show. It's very difficult on such a small stage to do this act, but ooh, they're wonderful. Ladies and gentlemen, may I present to you... We work from Maine to Mexico, there's nothing like this Texaco of ours. Our show tonight is powerful, we'll wow you with an hour full of howls from a shower full of stars. We're the merry Texaco men, tonight we may be showmen, tomorrow we'll be servicing your cars. I wipe the pipe, I pump the gas, I rub the hub, I scrub the glass. I touch the clutch, I mop the top, I poke the choke, I sell the pop. I clear the gear, I block the knock, I jack the back, I set the clock. So join the ranks of those who go and fill your tanks with Texaco. Sky Team, fill up with Sky Team, and you will smile at the pile of new miles you will add. Fire Team, fill up with Fire Team, you'll find that Texaco's the finest friend your car has ever had. And now, ladies and gentlemen, introducing America's number one television star, your Tuesday night, Milton Berle! Don't laugh, lady. This is my nag. What are you, your husband's? <laughs> Fine. How do I look? Tell us. <laughs> I want... Don't applaud. All right. Don't applaud. Hold it. I... A little tired out. He's been working like a man all day. I do... Uh, <laughs> he's been working like a man. I can see he's going to be lousy. Good night. <laughs> I want to tell you... I really... I really feel... I, uh, don't I look funny? I look like an advance agent for Margaret Truman's concerts. <laughs> Okay. Incidentally, a report just came over the air that Margaret Truman just gave Carmen Lombardo 24 hours to get out of town. <laughs> and I'm giving you two minutes. <laughs> thank you very much. I want, thank you, Mother. Stay in. The, uh, my mother, she's here. How do you feel? All right. Take a boo. I, uh, she's loaded. It, uh, <laughs> with money, with money. I want to tell you, tell, 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 my mother told me there'd be nights like this. I better take this off. No kidding. Would you do me a favor and take this? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's me, Milton. <laughs> Didn't you know? It was me. <laughs> I want to tell you, I, you heard of Henry V? I look like Burl after the eighth. <laughs> I loused that up. I told that in a serotan way, backwards. But this, uh, but this, I feel happy tonight. After all, what is happiness? You can't buy money with it. But it is peculiar. You can't buy money with it. <laughs> There's a bus leaving. It is peculiar. What's a musician coming in now? It's a little late. Hey, what are you coming in now? It's all right. I'll buy you another one. I'll buy you another one. You go over to Wurlitzers, tell them I sent you, and they'll give you my regards. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm only kidding. You've you got a strong union. I'd like you to meet the conductor of our orchestra tonight. If he's a conductor, I want to transfer. He's really wonderful. Alan Roth. Let's give him a big hand. Alan Roth! We have... We have a very long show, and we're going to get started tonight. And all you boys and girls, do you like me? Don't I look, don't I look like when knighthood was in flower tonight? We're going, don't applaud at everything I say. Take down the applause cards. Ladies, <laughs> ladies and germs, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to introduce our first... We have such a long show. We want to get the whole show in tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to introduce our first surprise. <laughs> 